Hello Rovers! In this video, we are going to share our views on the first banner of version 1.2 in Weathering Waves, which will feature JG. And you must all be wondering, is JG a must-have resonator? In what team she can be used? And do you need her signature weapon? Watch till the end as we will cover all of these questions. Visually, JG seems very pleasing, and her animations are very cool. On paper, she is great at what she does, providing good off-field DPS. She offers 15 resonance energy to the next resonator and resonance skill damage amplification. Any team that uses Sampa could have JG instead but mostly she is going to replace Yinling from your Jin C team, allowing you to play Yinling with Colcharo or Zhang Li Yao. Check our team's guide for version 1.2 infographics for more team synergies. Now, when it comes to sequences, if you're willing to spend, then S2 would be a good stopping point, as it gives 10% critical rate and 15 resonance energy back when the resonance skill Creation Zenith is used. This might improve her rotation, while the remaining sequences are just going to increase her damage output. Nevertheless, we will have to test that upon her release. As for the 4-star resonators on the banner and their sequences, Chishia has some great sequences and are good picks if you want to main her. Baiji's sequences are not so important and even her S6, which buffs Glacio damage, is not that much needed unless you play Mono Glacio team. Sanhua's sequences have great value across the board and make her playstyle less demanding. Let's look at the weapon banner. The Rhyme Draped Sprouts is the best in slot for JG as it considerably buffs her basic attacks. Most of JG's damage counts as basic attacks, so this weapon will provide a nice pump on your numbers. However, there is no big diff. Stringless is her second best option, closely followed by Cosmic Ripples. Unfortunately, Rhyme Draped Sprouts is super niche, and I don't see other resonators being able to use it except Angkor, but for Angkor, it should be her new best in slot. Finally, the four star weapons in the banner are the Dauntless, which you don't need, but if you you do need it for Tauchi, for instance, then refinements are easy to come by. Then there is Jinsu Keeper, which is good for Verena, but not a must have. However, Variation or Cosmic Ripples are great alternatives. And the Holomy Rush is quite niche, but markedly is better in most cases. That was it for this video. Let us know down in the comments if you are going to summon for JG, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Thank you very much for watching, and make sure to check us out on Twitch, where we will summon on one lucky viewer's account until they get JG. You can find more info on how to participate in the giveaway in the pinned comment. Bye!